Understanding, bring a hat or cap. A guide for English language learners. Hello everyone. Today, we're diving into a common English phrase that you might encounter in everyday conversations or instructions. Bring a hat or cap. This simple request carries specific implications and cultural nuances that are worth exploring, especially for those learning English. So, let's unravel the layers behind this phrase and understand how to use it effectively in various contexts. The phrase, bring a hat or cap, is a straightforward request or suggestion that someone carry a hat or cap with them. It's often used in scenarios where protection from the sun or weather is anticipated. Let's look at each word to fully grasp the meaning. Bring, to carry or come with something. It's an action you take when you're asked to transport something from one place to another. A hat or cap. This refers to two types of headwear that serve similar purposes, protection from the sun, rain, or just as a fashion statement. A hat can be any head covering with a brim, while a cap typically has a visor or no brim and fits more snugly around the head. Understanding when and why this phrase is used can help learners apply it appropriately. Outdoor events. If you're attending a picnic, sports game, or any outdoor gathering, you might hear this advice. It implies that you'll be under the sun for hours, and bringing a hat or cap can protect you from sunburn or heat stroke. Traveling. Before going on a trip, especially to sunny destinations, this phrase is a gentle reminder to pack something to shield your head from the sun. Health and safety reasons. In contexts where exposure to the elements could pose a health risk, this phrase acts as a precautionary suggestion. The phrase can carry different cultural nuances depending on where it's used. In some cultures, wearing hats or caps is a sign of style or social status, while in others, it's purely for practical reasons. It's also worth noting that the choice between hat or cap might reflect personal taste or the specific activity planned. Bring a hat or cap is more than just a simple request. It's a phrase rich with practical advice, health considerations, and sometimes cultural implications. Whether you're learning English for travel, work, or personal enrichment, understanding these everyday phrases can significantly enhance your communication skills. We hope this video has shed light on how to interpret and use this common suggestion. Stay curious and happy learning. Remember, the key to mastering a new language lies in understanding the context and nuances of its phrases. So, don't forget to bring a hat or cap next time you step out into the sun.